So a number of people have been asking me about uh, <clears throat> gear in my studio. It's not terribly tidy right now. Um, usually, um, I'm recording through uh, my Friedman SS. Uh, it's a fractal above it, which I sometimes use. Um, and please understand that this is uh, gear that I've accumulated over 20 years. And um, you don't need all this stuff <laughs> to record with. Um, certainly not now with what you can do on laptops and stuff. So, um, yeah, it usually starts with uh, my Friedman SS tracking. Um, let's see here. Some keyboard stuff. My little prog setup. Moog Taurus. Um, Mellotron. Another Moog, uh, my controller, Roland controller. Um, so from the uh, Friedman, usually go, uh, let's see here, which way we go with? Okay, let's go here. Um, and that, uh, lately I've been using um, IR files, so, um, it's a combination of stuff up here. There's a two notes unit that I've been using lately. Um, let's see here. Uh, Ox, Sir, Load. Uh, it's one of my synth modules I really like, actually. Uh, Hydra synth. Um, and then into a mic pre uh, out, um, either API, um, or there's a bunch of BAE stuff over here that I use as well. Just depends what I'm looking for. The API is very quick and precise and, and the, uh, and the BAE is a little bit more, has a little bit more softness to it, roundness to it. Um, let's see. What else might you guys be interested in? Um... Those are all mic pre's. Um, oh, this is kind of cool. This is my original uh, Rockman module. I've somehow managed to keep it in good condition. This dates back way back to the 80s. Um, the unit above it, uh, Digidesign uh, 11. I don't use some older stuff in here. I don't, don't really use that. It's my um, radial JD7. I love that unit for multi amps and printing. Um, I usually print a DI at the same time as printing anything else. So, um, Universal Audio. Uh, the Apogee below is not being used anymore. Um, I'm now firmly in the UAE camp. Uh, uh, Moog synth, Mac, um, just ordinary stuff there. Uh, computer, it's Mac Tower. Oh, this is cool. This is my newest Nags guitar here. This is uh, the Severns, and uh, it's the latest one. It has a sustainer in it, which is kind of cool, and a kind of snaky print. Um, let's go over here. Um, I use Logic Audio. Sorry about that. My camera's going crazy. Uh, I record on Logic over there. Uh, there's another keyboard controller, uh, monitor. Um, and then everything, I'm old school, so I like to have all my returns come back. All my channels of Logic uh return on here i don't know what my camera is doing here um <laughs> it's going a bit wild uh but uh api box unit everything is um not in the box <laughs> um so all my logic channels return there and then i have some virtual keys and stuff that come back on my earlier channels um let's see here good old trusty uh, Yamaha um, speakers, which I've had since the 80s, although the 
the speakers are newer replacements. Um, Dyn Audio monitors, which I really like. Um, when I did uh, my Memory Crash album, uh, Michael Parnon, the mix co-producer, uh, had Dyn Audios and I, I liked them. Um, they're not too hypey, but they get the job done. Um, what else might that be? I think that's about it, really. Um, ask me any questions. I'll answer anything you want. Um, but that's about it. Thanks, guys.